Hey guys, it's Tumin here. Today I'm going to be showing you this great app. It's called Overscreen. It's a pretty cool app. I think you guys like it as well as I do. So without any further ado, let's begin this video. Alright guys, so Overscreen is a floating browser and just like the title says, it has a bunch of browsers on your home screen so you can have a browser open and still use another app like YouTube or the market or something cool like that. Um, it works for 2.2 or higher. It costs $1.49. It's by the creators of MBFG and this is what happens when you open it up. The first thing that's going to happen is it's a little window. So I'm going to bring over my tablet and here it is. So I'm just going to open up over screen. Right there right when I open it up, I can grab the top bar, drag it around and right here the little bottom corner you can choose to make it smaller make it bigger these are little search bars uh, they're just like the Android original browser so here I go right when I open up YouTube the first thing that you're gonna see it's in mobile version and it's pretty nice this browser is just like a regular browser you could do anything on it watch YouTube videos Netflix uh, right here this little bubble you can choose the option to go back go again go forward then refresh the page and then go to the home page now if I go to these little three buttons right here what I could do is to open up a new window which you could have as many windows as open as you want um, I've had up to four because I don't really need a lot of windows open you could also add bookmarks and it just edits and it just takes you to the bookmark editing section alright then right down there it says share page right when you tap on that little bar opens and you can slide through it tap on one to share the page uh, you also have the ability to copy the Earl desktop version for example right here I'm on the mobile version of the tablet so right there tablet version I can choose the desktop version and it's gonna take me to the desktop version that's the desktop version you can see it's a little bit better bookmarks has this old little section right here you can go on any of the following so let's just go on um, eBay and right there automatically it brings me up to the eBay page and anything, everything works just fine. If you go into the settings, it's just like a general settings for the browser. So right in here you can set the home page and privacy and security. You can clear the cache, history, um, the cookies, enable the location for Google, uh, remember the passwords, and clear all the passwords. Advanced, you have the user agent as default. You can enable the JavaScripts, the plugins, um, the URL page. You can enable videos and you can auto hide notifications and all that. Load images, these are load images like on web pages. If you don't want them to load, then just go ahead and just tap on that. It's not going to load up. And just about is share it, get more apps that they have, and contact them if you have any problems. So let me just go back on my phone, show you guys YouTube, because they do have their own video player for YouTube. So right here, I'm on the little browser, and it's pretty cool. I'm on a YouTube page. I'm just going to show you guys that it does work. This is the Mobile World Congress of last year. Let me just show you how neat it is. So it's an own video player, and works just fine. right there it works just fine as you can see no lag uh, this video does have a lot of frames per second and as you saw you can tap it on to play it and pause it just by tapping it again and right there the little X it just closes it and it tells you where you're at and right there you can choose what's where you want to go so for example if you want it up there just play that go back here play that and no lag whatsoever it's pretty cool so this is pretty nice um, you could also have the feature of double tapping on one and then it goes away and then you could drag it around like that and then you go down the one, go down this one and then it's like a little window and then down here in the notifications these are all the windows that are open for example if you minimize it with the little button over here it just goes into the notification uh, these are all the windows that I have open and right down there it says tap to terminate over screen let's say you have a bunch of screens open or windows you just tap on that 
and it closes all the pages automatically, which is pretty nice. Um, you can have it open in any in anything. For example, if I go into one of my apps, let's just go into YouTube. So it's, it works just fine, no lag of whatsoever. Um, everything works, and it's pretty cool. And for a limited time edition, you can get the price off for 50% off. It's 50% off, guys. So usually it will cost around two dollars and something cents, but right now it costs dollar forty-nine. So get it while you still can in a 50% offer. So hurry up. So you can watch YouTube, you can watch Netflix, and you can make applesauce out of your friend's iPhone. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you liked the video. Um, please rate, comment, and subscribe as you can see right there. And I'll see you guys in the next video.